Good morning, everybody. We're going to send it on over to the Today Show in just a minute. But first, here's a preview of what's coming up on Mornings on Fox 11. Gianna Georgie is going to be reporting live from the Atlantis, telling us all about Rand Paul's visit to Reno happening today. Plus, Gianna also had a chance to sit down with actor Kevin Dillon from Entourage. We're going to have the interview for you. And Kimberly Wade from the Nevada Humane Society stops by with a cat. That will be available for adoption. That and a lot more, including your lunchbox battle, coming up in less than five minutes, guys. Love it. Kevin Dillon's Johnny mm -hmm. in that show, Entourage. Huh? Yeah. Good stuff. Funny guy. All right. Looking forward to that. That's coming up in a couple of minutes. First of all, let's get a final look at our forecast. Yeah. So we're returning to those hot temperatures again today. We got a break yesterday with all that cloud cover, but now we're returning to near 100 degrees and even higher than 100 degrees starting tomorrow here in Reno Sparks. Not far from records for the next several days again. I feel like a broken record after last week talking about this all week last week. And we're week still too. in June, buddy. And we're still in June. July starts not too long from now, though. What is it, Tuesday, July 1st or Wednesday? I don't know. Wednesday. 20% chance for some isolated storms out there for the seven day forecast. So, a slight chance for activity, but again, it is hit or miss variety storms. So, we are talking about some folks won't see them, some folks will, and that's just the nature of this kind of thing. But we'll be watching for some lightning strikes over the next few days. Again, temperatures near 100 in Carson City all the way through the work week, and then a little bit cooler by the weekend, July 4th on Saturday, I believe. So, yeah. slightly cooler by then. I love those afternoon thunderstorms. Mm. All right. Thank you, Tim. Thanks for joining. Thanks, everybody. We have the Today Show coming up for you next here on News 4. If you'd like more local news and weather, come join us. We're going to be over at Mornings on Fox 11. We will see you there.